Welcome back everyone, welcome back to Let's Play XCOM Apocalypse. I got a bunch of skeletoids down, and a spitter, and two poopers there, and a multi-worm that's gone to sleep because it's tired. And now we have to find the rest of these jokers. And, uh, I wonder where they are. Oh man, this is gonna be a lot of- well, actually, I don't know, we'll see. Uh, why can you not get up? Hello? Okay, so yeah, these uh, places are pretty bad. Lots of small little corridors and we're out of stamina already. Brilliant. That's just lovely. Lovely. I love it. I love it so much. I'm just going to stay here for now. Check this corner. Oh, everyone out of stamina. It's so horrible. And you're gonna help her. If you have any time units left after this. There we go. Well, that should be okay. Right, you guys. Uh, hmm. We've got one big fat guy all the way up here, don't we? There we go. And apparently, there's stuff going on down here in this giant thing thingamajig. So let's see if we can find something. Is it just gonna be a spiral down? Oh, man probably is okay what do we have oh hello how many time units do you have left 33 wait how does oh did a lot of this stuff fall down i mean even here oh no you're you're out of uh toxins oh this is gonna be interesting if these guys react ooh. Excellent, and that was it. Brilliant. And it didn't explode. <laughs> okay. Okay, now I have to remember. Rearm, rearm, rearm agents before I do anything else. Rearm the agents. Go back. <sighs> and of course, uh, Tarangator here is probably going to start shooting crazy, so I'm going to put him on, on uh, chill out mode. Chill out, dude. Or chill dude mode. Very little traffic in the future. Must be very nice driving around. You know, apart from all the shooting and the aliens and everything. Alright, so we don't really want anything because we have everything. Nothing new here. So, first of all, we have to rearm agents. And then we're going to continue looking if there's any more aliens around. Even though the, the stupid graphs don't really show us anything. Oh, we only have five toxins. That sucks. They're not producing enough. Oh, we also need more uh, more of these. More stun grenades. Because they're very, very useful also. Lovely music. Okay. Sort of very... Um, I always found the music in XCOM Apocalypse when it's, when it's like this. Um, very sort of sad melancholic or something I suppose uh, and now we need to get more grenades more grenades if you require them make a ball stun grenade just all of them uh, smoke grenade none of this stuff I really want to keep new Mars like heavy launcher I never use these things Marsic mini launcher, same. Although, you know what? I'm going to keep them because uh, you can actually make uh, stun rockets for them, I believe. Stun grapples, toxic gun type B, only five of them. Disruptor guns, don't really need these. Lots of devastators to sell. Look at that money. Lovely. Could actually pay off uh, Sanctuary Clinic with that. Lots of brain circuit launchers. I'm just going to sell them. We got 25 shields. That's really good. I usually give two uh, for each agent uh, because they stack or well, yeah, they stack. But, you know, as soon as they destroy half of it, one of these will uh, will be gone. Uh, body armor, Marsha leg units, blah, blah, blah. Okay, that's pretty good. Look at that. 57,000. Let's wait for our stun grenades to arrive. There we go. I think that was it. 
Okay, so uh, more stun grenades. Excellent. Ah, now it's automatically re-equipped them, I think. Well, no. I should have done that before. Look at that accuracy. That's excellent. I should also make sure that uh, my toxic guns... My toxy gun guys have enough uh, ammunition. <clears throat> Control Alt. Those stats are going up nicely. I like it. XO. Yeah, fine. I, yeah, I want it like that. Crack is going to get one of these as well. Subbot did some amazing saving of his buddy. One big fat guy. Uh, you've don't have a lot of stamina to begin with. I mean, you do, but it goes down very fast with that. Uh, you could use a stun thingy as well, I suppose. More stun grenades! Ubar, who was cloned momentarily. And H. Walsh, who's quite hurt. Alright, now let's also make sure that uh, we give the toxic gun ammunition. I know one big fat guy is practically out. So let's do that first before we uh, fill these guys. There we go. It's practically out and the clip in his gun is practically out. So I'm going to give him another one here. Okay, just enough. We really need more production here. We're making another workshop, so that's going to help. But of course, you know, for now... So let's save here. And of course, get the music back up. So now I'd like to check more of these places because that is very, very, very strange what's going on here. So we've checked all of these three buildings. This is the same building. So we're going to check. I don't know. We're just going to keep going. Oh, that's a bigger building. Nice. I hate these tiny little ones because it just means there's loads of them. I love this track. Okay, so I'm gonna save here. There. And also check this. So Sanctuary Clinic is here. They still want 54,000. I'm almost inclined to actually pay them because I don't want these guys uh, angry with me. See, maybe, maybe the aliens will go there as well. I don't know. Anyway, uh, let's start checking these places. There's nothing here. Uh, let's go to that place. Nothing here. Let's go to that place. Let's just do it in, uh, in, uh, lines. Oops, I didn't want to do that. <sighs> I clicked too much. Yeah, see, look at that. Osiron Sanctuary Clinic, Marsec, Entropians. What the hell? Where are they coming from? And now I have to reload from here because I accidentally misclicked. I mean, accidentally misclicked. That's uh, that's silly. It's like I I accidentally crashed. Yeah, it's like okay, you you wanted to crash then. At other times, nothing here. So where the heck are they? There they are. What? How? I don't, I don't understand. How are they in so many places? Unless, of course, we've completely missed one of the UFOs offloading. We must have. That, and see, this is why it is so important to keep tabs on where the UFOs are offloading. So important. You know what? I'm going to pay Sanctuary Clinic. I, I can't help it. I don't want them to be uh, angry with us. Let's see how much they want to be friendly. <laughs> 94,000. 94,000. Oh, man. 94 flippin' thousand. That's a joke. Okay, it is... What kind of a slum map? Uh, well, no, actually, this one is good because it only has this giant thing, I believe. I don't think it has any sort of apartments and such. It's just a, an industrial wasteland, I think. Right, uh, it's going to be dangerous though, so we're going to go 
Oh, already see them. That's excellent. So there's an egg there. So you can see... Okay, the Androbots, the usual place where they, where they park themselves. However, I think I also want to check this area up here. Ah. Ah. There they are. Little shits. Now, can I get there? Okay, come on. Don't miss. No. No, come on. Excellent. Excellent. Alright. That's pretty good. And nothing there, right? Okay, that wasn't bad, actually. So now, what I'd like to do... Come on. Fly. Is there someone above you? What? What's, what's going on? Fly? Oh, you don't have flying armor. <laughs> I thought he had flying armor. Hmm. So, I want to throw a stun grenade. Our lovely new batch of stun grenades. They still have that uh, new new smell to them. Can you throw that far? Most likely not. But I'm definitely gonna try. Ooh, excellent! They didn't even turn around. Very nicely done. Okay. Um, let's hide over here for now. That was very nicely done, actually. LP573. Just gonna hide over here. Actually, you know what? We have to check this area, even though we do have someone flying above there. But just in case, with zero time units, of course. And of course, LP573 is a uh, android, so he doesn't care about any possible stray... Um, stray brain suckers. Right, these guys are all here. Let me take one of these guys. Just check the stairs here. Make sure there's nothing weird going on there. And apparently there isn't. Okay. And all of these guys can actually fly. So apparently, if you have them fly on the very first move, they don't use the stamina. Which is kind of weird, because when they are flying, they shouldn't be using their stamina. And that's it. Period. Okay, let's get them there. And where is this group? Uh, also over here. Yeah, most of the fighting is going to take around, take place there, probably. Pick, 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 pick. Alright, I think we're going to end the turn here. Hopefully those uh, anthropods will move around just slowly and fall asleep. It sounded like it, that they did. But of course, it's not a given. Now, the coolest thing is when, when you end the turn like this, it ends the civilian turn. And then it just says, um, you know, every enemy unit is unconscious or dead or whatever. But no, it didn't say that. So, let's see what we have. What is left? Oh, no, they didn't uh, fall asleep. However, these guys aren't really equipped for taking them out. Unfortunately, these guys are. But that's going to be a long way around. Kyle McVicker. Uh, can you get there? Oh, hello. Oh, oh, stop it, stop it. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of, these guys. Okay, that's a disruptor gun. Oh, look at that. You see that? That's the kind of damage these disruptors, I mean, uh, devastators can do. So, can you hit this guy reliably? Oh, nice, he's already unconscious. Come on. Nice. And that should be it. Nice. Oh, that was a good mission. But where the heck is all of this coming from? Okay, we're going to continue searching. I'm going to save here. Of course, have the... There we go. Where are they all coming from? Because we've checked this. Let's check the next building. The self. Not here. that building <laughs> they're everywhere in the slums what 
And I gotta reload because of uh, because of self. I really want to be on bad terms with self either. I mean, I don't want to be on bad terms with anyone except Cult of Sirius. That's so weird. We must have missed it, but it, you know, we've just fought these aliens after the UFOs offloaded. It hasn't really been that much time, so how the heck? Have the aliens spread around so much? I'm sure someone will explain it, but I don't I don't know. Oh good, is this one. Is the giant apartment block. Uh, always a fun map. I lost a few people here as well. Well, right, let's start with the first group. So at least, at least they don't start all the way back there in the corner. That's good. Uh, let's have one big fat guy fly. And one big fat guy flew away. There's an entrance. What the heck are you doing? What? That was just a bizarre maneuver. Okay, you know what? I don't like that. Because you don't have any more time units. Get these guys, have them run over here. They're usually here. So, uh, usually come out of there, so we gotta be careful. Gots to be careful. Alright, next group. Mm, most of these guys can fly, so let's, let's take the third group for now. And, uh, have someone check this area. Hello? Nothing for now. Control Alt. Let's go check further up. These places are just a mess of engineer or architecture. You've got to. You got to be careful though, because uh, a lot of the times they'll run out of there or there and just make our day really bad. Okay, uh, let's run over here, and let's have these guys all fly, like so, oops, no, no, not you, and then we'll have them fly up here to this place, because that's where they usually appear. Okay, now they're all looking that way. I'm going to end the turn. Okay, there's a brain sucker and it's all the way over there. That's good. Oh, very nice shot. Oh, there's an anthropod somewhere. Probably on those large, uh, in that large staircase. Wait a second, is it on the staircase? It, well, it's obviously on the staircase, but in the large, well, I mean, in the large staircase area, I suppose. <laughs> Right, so the anthropod is probably down there. Mm. Let's have these guys check the place out first. Ah, hello. Aloha. You can see that anthropod. I don't know what he's carrying. I cannot quite see that. Okay. Uh, Kitsune MP9. I'd rather have Delta Tree go over there. Because he's got a toxic on him. Hello. Look at that. Accuracy is brilliant. And it's only two per. <sighs> Amazing. Yeah, that was a devastator. And uh, that's kind of dangerous, though, because if there's more of them coming out. Uh, yeah. It's not going to be very good. So I think what I'm going to do preemptively is maybe throw a grenade. I'm not sure. Let's see first. Move everyone else first and uh, then see what we're going to do. So let's check this area. Just check these rooms. Nothing. I'll stay there for now. Still have stamina. Excellent. I'm actually gonna... No, no, wait. 
yeah, fine, go up, even though you barely have any time units. But at least brain suckers can't really hurt you. Um, I can check these areas now with Control Alt. Even though it doesn't really appear there's anything there. I mean, we have to check these two corners, but. Right, there's nothing here. Alright, Rex a million. Cling, 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 cling. So we're gonna start moving towards that area there. Um, that is exactly what we are going to do. Huh. That's a really stupid idea to go all that far. There you go. I am full of stupid ideas. Okay. Uh, now, this area. There's almost definitely going to be something here. As usually is, but I suppose not in this case. Huh. I'm going to do a more thorough check of these rooms here, because, uh, like I said, usually they are there. Hello? Hello? No. Anything here? Nothing. So they must be... All the way over there. Where that brain sucker came from. There's probably more of them there. Okay, so that's actually that area. Covered. Okay. Yeah, either uh, LP573 or um, FUBAR did those shots. That was pretty impressive. Anyone else that I haven't moved? Probably, but uh, these two guys. Hmm. Either a smoke grenade so they cannot see out or a stun grenade, but that still allows them to shoot me. So I think I'm going to use a smoke grenade. And just uh, block off this area. Oh, that wasn't the best, but okay. So hopefully, if they come out... Oh, hello, Mr. Skeletoid. Oh, he's firing at those guys up there now. It might be the last one. That was a very short alien turn. I like it when that happens, because you know that you're almost done. <laughs> okay. So, we've got Fubar over there, but unfortunately, he doesn't have... A Toxigun. Because I'd like him to get more experience. Alright. Run, run, run. All the way over there, Rexamillion. Even though that guy has a Devastator Cannon. And that was it. Lovely jubbly. Okay. Now. Once again. We're going to save. We are getting so much score killing all these aliens and such that, uh, yeah... It's going to get pretty interesting what the aliens throw at us next. I'm guessing already new UFOs and such. I mean, bigger ones. Because, uh, yeah, we've been doing... Excellent. Wait a second. Is that the same building? No, there's another building there. So many buildings around. I hate the slums. Okay, so no hostile forces discovered here. I'm just going to do this one as well. No hostile forces... No hostile forces. Okay, so far so good. Uh, we've already done this one. I'm just going to double check. No hostile forces. And we've just got th these three buildings here in the slum. But then I also want to check further up into the city. Because that was very weird that they spread that much. There must be something fishy going on there in one of those buildings. Unless they've... Um, you know, spread from all of these buildings there. No, there we go. There's more. How? I don't... Uh, uh, uh. Okay, let's... Uh, uh. Man, these slums are such giant maps. Okay, so we said... This last building here. Off we go. Man, these things are everywhere. Everywhere. 
All right, and we get another one of those castles again, apparently. Hmm. I mean, it's not too bad, I suppose. There's not that many places to hide, which is nice. Okay, so, first of all, I want uh, one big fat guy to check this out. He's gonna fly. And he's gonna try to catch him with their pants down, even though aliens don't really wear pants. Um... Don't really want him to walk. Nothing there? Huh. Okay. Nothing there, apparently. Go, go, go. They're gonna be all hiding here or something. Alright, there's the anthropod. Can you throw a stun grenade all the way over there? We are getting so many uh, personal sh uh, shields. It's excellent to fire the throw. There we go. Come on. No. Wrong. Ah. Wrong. No, no. Can you throw that far? Probably not. Throw. Come on. Perfect. Excellent. Because it hit this area, not these spots here, that means that it's also going to go in here, into this little corner, where more of the anthropods most likely are. That was actually pretty good. Alright, so, let's get a bit closer. It wasn't bad. Okay, so, next team. Um, there's a lot of them. Can I get everyone over here somehow to sort of not get killed? It's not the best, especially because they're all... Oh, this is interesting. And of course, none of these guys can fly. However, we do have Devastator Cannons, which means we can just do this. Make a nice little hole. I would like to make holes here as well to go and check this area, but... Let's see, nothing here. Nothing here. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna stay here. Toxins, please. And you've got toxins as well, so you're gonna go around here and make sure that this area is clear. And in fact, yeah, going around is quite dangerous, so we're not gonna do that. We're gonna have Captain K as a backup here <laughs> with a rocket launcher. I think that's it. All right, let's see what happens. Come on, fall asleep. Ah, he didn't yet, but he's run through some of the gas, so he should. Oh, he's only got a. I mean, disruptor gun. So he should only take a couple more shots with a toxic gun, and he'll be down. No, don't, don't waste the toxic gun there. Come on. Jeez. Oh. See, that was the shield. Nice shot, though. And, you know, the shield didn't do... I mean... Oh, nice! That was it. The uh, hit to the shield didn't really do anything apart from taking some of the shield down. That Toxigum clip... I mean, uh, Sean did the trick, though. So, we've done all of the slums here now. I'm going to save this. And uh, we're going to continue next time when we still search for more aliens. It's very weird. Have a good one, and I'll see you then. Bye-bye.